Hi, in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to make my site secure on Bluehost. So, the first thing this we'd like to do, of course, is just go and open whatever browser you are going to use to follow this tutorial steps with. Here, in my case, I'm actually using Brave. But, of course, in your case, you can use any other browser could be possibly working for you. Once you open this browser, make sure to go into this URL section and simply type bluehost.com and hit the enter button, which will actually take you into this page which is going to be your home screen or your main screen on the Bluehost website. Of course, if you want to log in into your account and if you already have it, simply click as login button at the top right corner. And if you don't have an account, you'll have to click at get started or simply because this choice will get you to choose a plan and it's going to be a bit expensive because you will have to commit with them for one year. You can simply just go and buy your own domain. By clicking at this domains option right here, and of course, it will take you to the page that will give you the opportunity to buy your domain from. And from there, you can start and create your account with that way also. So for me, I'm just going to click at login, which will log in into my account directly because I already logged in into my account in this PC. And that is going to be my screen once I logged in into my account. So as we said in the beginning of this tutorial, we would like to make my, uh, our sites like secure. Simply once you click at my site here, as you can see, you'll find your website right here. Or if you click at, of course, you can click at manage sites. And as you can see, once you are here, you can go up into the security option and click on it. And as you can see, make sure before everything that you enable those two options, which is the SSL certificate list encrypt and enforce HTTPS. One will uh, help keep information like login, password, and customer credit card number safe. And one will force a secure connection to your website to provide a safe and secure browsing experience to your visitors. Of course, you can even check the core uh, WordPress file by clicking here to scan the core files. And you can even upgrade your security with a plan that you can pay for. So this will be actually for the tutorial. I hope you like it. Thank you guys for watching and goodbye.